This is your bathroom mystic here. Thanks for checking us out. Really look forward to working with you today. Let's pull the cards and see what the guides have to say for us today. Ooh, very cool California coast picture. Let's talk about this card, but let's break it up into three parts. The first part is the top, and that's the sky, the sky people. It is a blue sky, but it's got a little bit of clouds in there. So when there's a little cloudy in your communication, it's telling me that either you're not fully hearing what people are saying, or you're not speaking your truths and you're holding back on something and you're not telling the whole story. So in order to get this sky to be beautiful blue, you either need to pull the cotton balls out of your ears or a <coughs> clear throat and get that hairball out and actually speak your truths and what it is that's important to you. Blue is communication. The second layer of this is the ocean itself. And this is talking about going with the flow. And if you look at this, the water is pulling back right now, but it's getting ready to push in. It's not a ginormous wave. It's not a tsunami, but it's the ebb and flow of life. So it's also telling us to go with the flow, that things are going to happen quickly, and then they might slow down, and then it's going to happen fast again, and then it might slow down. So the water here is telling us just to stay in the flow and go with it as it goes. The bottom part of this card has stone people in it. And for me, stone people often represent family. And I don't just mean your genetic family. I mean your family that you go and sit at the bar with, the family that you go and do your circles with, the family that you go and, and have created across the entire world. You know, your soul family, your tribe. This family is making pathways for you. And they're showing you that you have different ways that you can get to this point. That's the pretty cool thing. There's three options, free will, but all three options go to the same point. Now, because of free will, if you want, you can go off the card and go down the cliff on the other side there and crash. No judgment, no judgment. Or you can choose one of these paths that your soul family or your friends and have set up for you, and they're gonna support you the whole way. The other thing this card's telling me is that if you have choices in front of you, whatever you choose is gonna be the right answer. Don't waste your time trying to make lists and trying to figure out what's the right answer. I did some math and I figured out years ago that I spent over 72 hours worrying about the mileage on my leased vehicle. 72 hours, 72 hours. I did math, I worried, I fretted over something that ended up never affecting me. I never got fined, I never, or I didn't go over the miles, or I bought the vehicle. I mean, there's a million different things that could have happened, but I spent 72 hours wasting time on a choice when whatever I did, it still took me to the same path. I didn't need to spend those 72 hours worrying. Just think of all the things I could have done in 72 hours. Why, I could have done more than baked a cake. I mean, that's a, that's a good time for a vacation. Wow, 72 hours, that's in the past. So this card is telling you to know that you're fully supported by your family, your soul family, your tribe. Whatever choice you make, you will always find the right answer and go to the same place. And it's telling you to stay in the ebb and flow of life, to always communicate your truths and what you believe in. Ow! Oh. And looks like it's time for me to go. Hey, it's the bathroom mystic. Speak your truths.